In 2014, medicine is going towards more pinpoint targeted therapies for breast cancer. This allows us to increase the tumor control rates while decreasing side effects and exposure to lung and heart of radiation. To do targeted therapy, you clearly have to see the target. And this, in many cases, can be difficult. Post-operative changes don't last forever and they fade over time. And many of the surgeons now are closing the surgical cavity with a technique called oncoplastic surgery. This makes the cavity very difficult to see for radiation therapy to pinpoint hit that target. So it's important that we have a marker that is like a beacon for the radiation oncologist saying, aim the radiation to this spot. And this is what this new product called Biosorb does. It's clips embedded in a bioabsorbable material that stays put and clearly marks where the surgeon's been with the knife. The American Brachytherapy Society is clearly focused on partial breast irradiation. It is an expanding field and many of the doctors around the globe are very interested in offering this to their patients. So we submitted an abstract here about the Biosorb and it was accepted and will be uh, featured today at the meeting. And we're very pleased to present the outcomes of our study at this important meeting. We wanted to scientifically evaluate the Biosorb device and how it helps us take care of patients. So we decided to look at cases that we took care of with partial breast irradiation with the Biosorb device. We contoured where we thought the surgeon had been with the knife, ignoring the Biosorb, and then we did it with the Biosorb and we found that the target volumes, that is the part of the breast that's exposed to radiation, was more tightly confined at less radiation dose exposure uh, with the Biosorb device, and therefore we think it's going to decrease side effects and increase our accuracy of treatment.